on Omega Snake here, and this is a boss request for, well, quite a few people. During my long hiatus last year, a lot of people were requesting I show how to beat Monsoon, and, well, I never really got to it. But as I was going through Metal Gear Rising again to get to another boss request that someone requested, uh, I figured I might as well show how to beat Monsoon finally. <laughs> so, here's how to beat Monsoon. But before we get into it, there's a couple of things I want to say in preparation. Now, for body, well, I prefer the Grey Fox body. It's just a preference thing. You can wear whatever you want. But for the main weapon, the only thing you have is the HF blade. But during my Senator Armstrong boss strategy, I said do not put any enhancements on it. Because, well, for Armstrong, you're not going to be able to use the HF blade. And that still trolls true here, though, if you have the BP, I guess you can put some BP into its enhancements, but only if you have the a the BP to spare. Because remember, you need a lot of BP in order to upgrade your life and fuel cells. So that's the priority. If you have a lot of BP, I guess you can put a couple of enhancements into the HF blade. Though just remember, you won't be using it during the fight with Armstrong. But, yeah, anyway, for the unique weapon, well, all that's in here is the pole arm, but you do want the pole arm for this fight. <clears throat> it's actually really effective against Monsoon, as not only can it make him flinch, but it's also got multiple attacks, and that's going to be really good against him. So, yeah, make sure you have the pole arm. It's pretty effective against him. And, like I said... Um, make sure you have all the life and fuel cells you can get, which is only two at this point. I'm basically going through it as if it's the fir first playthrough. Because, you know, usually people who are on the first playthrough struggle with them. So <clears throat> at least, that's my, that's my uh, theory anyway. Anyway, for skills, um, there's really only one I can recommend, and that is the Aerial Parry. Because... Monsoon has an attack that where he can launch you into the air and then slam you back down for massive damage. The aerial parry allows you to actually block that block that attack if he somehow launches you into the air. You can basically save yourself from taking massive damage from the attack from the attack where he sends you downward. So yeah, aerial parry, good idea. And that's basically it. Um, yeah, that's actually basically it. Okay, so, with that out of the way, let's get to it. Oh, and like the fight with Armstrong, I say I saved at, right at the fight, so yeah, no cutscene. Alright, here we go! Alright, here we go. Oh boy. Okay, when he when he does this, you can't do really do anything. So you're just gonna have to block. That's one of the main things of this fight. If you don't, if you haven't mastered blocking at this point, you are in a lot of trouble. Okay, here we go. Basically, allow him to come to you. When he attacks, uh, unleash a counterattack. Hit. Yeah, he was about to try to kick me into the air. When he lifts his leg, he's gonna try to do a kick combo. When his sire blowing, yeah, he's gonna do that. That multi-hit combo. See? Yeah, don't... Yeah, parrying doesn't work on him. He'll just dodge it if you somehow parry it. My turn! Whoa! Yep, see? That's what you needed air the aerial parry for. No thanks, it's a filthy habit! Whoa! Remember, you lose your lock on it when he uses a phosphorus grenade. Hit! 
Okay, here we go. Alright, there's no point in chasing him, so just stand here. This one's on me. Yeah, after he's lost about 70%, once he's lost about 30% of his health, that's when he activates his electromagnetic generator. And he does this. So when he's at 70%, get ready. Okay. Now this is basically the point a lot of people have a lot of trouble with him. Because, well, with the electromagnetic generator on, he's a lot harder to hit. Like, almost impossible to hit. His attacks are more frequent and ferocious, and, well, yeah, yeah, he's just really, really annoying. <laughs> However, what if I told you that there's actually a way to knock out his electromagnetic generator before it actually becomes a problem? Because, you see, there is actually a way to, to uh, counteract his electromagnetic generator, and that's with the electromagnetic grenade. Yeah, if you throw an EMP grenade at him, it'll actually... In interrupt his electromagnetic generator and stun him. Then you can that will allow you to go into blade mode and well th here let me just show you. See? There we go. And no more electromagnetic generator. Yep. Just use an, an EMP grenade when he when his electromagnetic generator is on, and he becomes a lot less of a problem. Now you just gotta block his attacks. Just let him come to you. <laughs> yeah, he does this at around 50 to 40 percent. Yeah, every time he turns back on his electromagnetic generator, it, he will do this twice. Every time he turns on his electromagnetic generator. Yep, see? A lot less of a problem. Also, if you start running out of electromagnetic grenades, don't worry, because those things he those tanks he and helicopters he tosses at you actually have a chance of dropping an electromagnetic grenade. See? So yeah, so if you run out, don't worry, you can pick up some more. Alright, here we go. When he's at 40%, that's when he'll use his super attack. All you have to do is get ready to block it. You have to block it twice. One. Two. Here, my turn. Da, 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 Okay, he's too far away for an electromagnetic grenade, so get ready to block. Here's how you can counteract him if you don't have any EMP grenades. If you can actually parry his attacks, attacks, that's how you will that's how you can actually da damage him and stun him in order to be able to knock his electromagnetic generator offline. You just have to parry him. Of course that basically means you're gonna have to block him just before he hits. Just blocking it's not enough. You have to parry him when he has EM, his EM generator on. Otherwise, you'll never knock him out of it. Oh, and you have to basically parry the attack from his upper body. Because, you know, that's where his head is. Alright. Oh, 
like a flood of rain pouring down on me and it will not let up until the air is near and it will blow through the darkest day in the final hour and it will never rest until the clouds are clear until it finds my and disappears Sorry, I just really like that song. <laughs> Eat this! Never mind. Whoa! Okay, here we go. Yep. See, you just have to pay. You just have to parry him when his EM generator is up, and you can knock him out of it. All right. When he's at ten percent, then it's about time to end the. It's about time to end the fight. So get ready. His health won't go below ten percent, as you were, as you guys saw. <laughs> My turn. Alright, get ready to ninja run. I'll put you under weekly. Now what we can do, Ripper. You're dead. Dead on! Dead on. Dead, 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 dead. You're done. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Hasta la vista. Yeah. <laughs> You're done. Piece of cake. Eh, I guess I could have done a little better. But yeah, that's how you beat Monsoon, guys. Kill. Or be killed. Don't be ashamed. Don't be ashamed. It's, it's only, only nature running, running its course. course. Your, memes Your memes end here. No, I passed one to you. Sure as the sun will rise. The flood will continue. Now, I return to the earth. Ripper Mort tutorial is now playable in via VR missions. And, well, that's how you beat Monsoon, guys. I hope you enjoyed, and I hope this really helps you out for those who have been struggling with it. I know a lot of people Ryan? have. I'm fine, Kevin. Relax. I'll get the brains. I don't want this for anyone else. All right, man. Later. Well, anyway, I hope this helps you guys out. And if you want to help me out, remember that I actually have a Patreon. So, yeah. <clears throat> so, yeah, it's in the description below if you, if you want to support me. I'd really appreciate it. But, yep, that's basically how you beat Monsoon. Hope this helps you guys out, and I hope you enjoyed. This is Omega Snake signing out. See you guys next time. It's game over, Monsoon. But that's no reason to go to pieces. Oh wait, yes it is.